Welcome back to Bonne Vida on the channel for people new here. My name is Estia, and for the people who are already following me, welcome back to Bonne Vida on the channel. Into this video, we're going to try to get into the little summer spirit, guys. Okay, let me tell you how exactly why I'm exactly doing this video. You have to know that yesterday I had to do like a little film project for my class, and I did a little baking tutorial. I tried to do this baking tutorial. I'm not sure if it's going to turn out well, but I'm seriously crossing my fingers that it's going to turn out well. And I was just doing my project and my mom came into the living room. The reason why I'm filming in the living room is that the living room light is so much better than my own room and in the kitchen. So I did my video here. As you know, I don't have a ring light, so it was a little struggle to even find the perfect light and the positions because I'm only filming with my phone, so it can be really a struggle sometimes. And she came into the living room, she was asking me to buy her some eggs. I'm sorry, but the camera is not straight. She was asking me for eggs, so I went to the grocery store. At first, I was not like in the mood to go to the grocery store because i didn't want to to just pick an outfit to go to the grocery store you have to know that i was clothed like a homeless person that's always the case on weekends i'm not putting effort in my outfits but i'm never really putting effort in my outfit so nothing new but i put a little bit of effort legging and an oversized t-shirt that's not much effort but still and you have to know that i have a beautiful bike i got a bike last year from my dad and it's been such a freaking ass long time since i wore this bike so i was like you know what let me take this bike and go to the grocery store while i was riding i was listening to music and i was like you know what i don't want to listen to music so i put on some podcast about you from Final Never Meters and this podcast she was like talking about how to have the best summer and not to miss out on things on opportunities on occasions going out with your friends and also just living the best hot girl summer and i was just you know what that gives me the perfect excuse to do this video to try to get into the summer spirit to try to get a better version of myself and to try to get off my shelf to just to just try something with me and I don't know what happened yesterday, but I didn't want to film it yesterday, so I'm filming it now. Today is Sunday the 4th. Now it's perfect time to begin this video because I already cleaned up the entire living room, the apartment, and now I'm going to take my breakfast. And I'm just going to try today to get into a little summer spirit, to just vibe with the vibe. If it makes sense. I don't know if it makes sense to just wipe with the wipe. But I just want to get off the house a little bit to just enjoy the sun because the sun is finally coming out here in Germany and I'm so freaking freaking happy. After being a friend, I was afraid that the weather was going to be shitty as the previous weeks. Because you have to know in France the weather was so perfect, it was so nice to be there, to just lie around, to just do absolutely nothing. It was wonderful and now i'm back in germany and i'm so freaking glad that it's not raining like the last days and yeah guys so i'm just going to say let's get into the summer spirit Next step into getting into the summer spirit is to sort out my seasonal clothes. Let me tell you, I've been telling myself the last weeks that I'm going to order some new clothes. Summer clothes, spring clothes. The fact that I told myself this obligation every freaking single day is crazy. My closet only has hoodies, sweatshirts, sweaters, turtlenecks. I don't have any t-shirts anymore. I don't know what's wrong with me. Okay, I'm going to be honest. I change aesthetic. I still don't have the clothes for my aesthetic, but I want to change my entire closet. But the fact that everything is getting more expensive each day is crazy, guys. It's actually so crazy. A jeans for $60. How do I look like to you? $60 on a freaking ass jeans. This is looking affordable for you. Okay, depends on the brand. But still, I'm a teenager, 17 years old, and I'm still using the money of my parents. So sometimes i freaking hate to spend money i only spend money on food drinks or whatsoever but that's important okay let me tell you something really funny guys i don't know what's wrong with me but sometimes i might be sitting on my bed lying on my bed and do absolutely nothing or watching a movie but i tell you i'm not freaking hungry i'm seriously not hungry but i need to chew on something what's wrong with me what's wrong with me because my mouth 
is just bored of doing absolutely nothing. That's the reason why I always need a midnight snack. Because my mouth, I don't know what's what's wrong with me, but I just need to do something with it. I don't know if I'm the only one, just please comment down below if you're the exact same way as me. Because I'm feeling a little bit crazy. Because I'm guilty. I'm guilty. And guys, let me tell you, I'm so freaking happy that after my little trip to France or to Paris, I finally got my lip balm back. <laughs> I'm so over dramatic right now, but I have these mood swings. But anyways, guys, we're going to try to somehow change where my closet looks because my closet is always a freaking ass mess. We're going to try to somehow make my closet look presentable and also And also useful for the summer. <laughs> okay, five episodes of Case in a Cover Lady. We find in the kitchen, and it's currently 1 p.m. and we have to cook lunch, guys. We're going to cook lunch today. The sun is shining, and I need food, and especially Asian food because the last weeks I've been dying. <laughs> die to eat asian food i know that it's not exactly asian food but basically i'm going to try to cook china skillet chop suey but let me tell you guys asian food african food is so freaking delicious guys. let me tell you it's so delicious let me tell you the struggle as a student to come home to cook lunch to clean everything up my mom is gone and i have to cook for my sister and i and let me tell you guys i just feel so freaking grateful for my mom because the last days before going to Paris my mental health was so freaking bad it's not normal anymore it was so bad that I almost had a mental breakdown I was not okay my mental health was not the best and you have to know that okay my dad goes grocery shopping obviously he goes grocery shopping but don't put your trust in my dad to go grocery shopping for you my mom when she goes grocery shopping she always when it's tell me she buys everything for the house it was kind of weird that my mom wasn't here to cook something and i should really feel grateful for her always cooking for us after school that we have something on the plates but anyways guys we are going to cook this china skillet shop suey i apologize if i'm not pronouncing it right but i'm currently translating it in the water let the daughter find an image with the rest she'll be learning how to breathe Spinning through identity, reveal another pretty little scheme. Save her mind. Hold her hand. And don't believe a lie. You understand me. Walking down the valley, pack a piece of heaven for the bottoms of her feet. Teach her how to jump and how to stretch when she reach. Like the angels do, and you gon' make it through now. Tell about the healer Greater is the one within and call him as the leader Teach her how to hold a pretty hand up to the sky You have to know that as a goal I said myself that I'm going to try new things So, for example, I'm going to try to paint a beautiful picture with you guys I'm going to try to paint a beautiful picture here on my parents' bedrooms wall because the sun is so beautiful here in this room the light is so freaking good and I don't know I like the floor because it's really chill I'm not a good painter the fact that I cannot paint paint a proper sun is embarrassing it's actually really embarrassing but anyways guys so this is story time of why I'm going to tell you guys apparently I'm not a good painter in the eyes of my teacher we had to collect ideas creations and i had beautiful creation guys i really had so many creations and i still got for this book a d minus a freaking s d minus that's me who painted that who drew that an apple and a ball guys please tell me it looks realistic right i'm not sure if it's i got a d minus for this one but i got a d minus for the entire book second thing that i created let me tell you it's a wonderful idea you have a pen but at the end of the pen, you have like a little Tipex pen. D minus! I had different color combinations for this pen. Guys, it's... Oh, guys, when I tell you, it's... It's the reason why I don't have any art classes anymore. And I'm never going to get... I'm not even going to... No. And I have some random things here. Huh. They, these are things that I draw, apparently. 
but i have to say this among us is seriously really good then i have this thing but i got it from tiktok i think i got it from tiktok but anyways guys we're going to paint something i'm not sure what i'm going to paint but i'm definitely going to paint something really cool and something that has to do with the summer because i want to get into this uh summer spirit so i'm not sure what i'm going to paint but i have a big choice here because you have to know that i have many colors here okay that's why we never have nice things with me i have a big choice of colors and i'm really happy that i have big choice of colors and i have my water here because my mom hates when we're using her glasses to paint something so i'm going to use that and guys we're going to see what i'm going to paint come and take a look at me going back to what i used to know but please hold my hand as i go down this road guys that's the picture i just painted and i just draw guys i don't know what i should think about this picture because i somehow like it because can i don't know if you can see that but the ch colors are changing on other drops like yellow orange red a little bit of red but i didn't really use red and here brown actually I like this especially the drops here i don't know how to describe it but if the drops wouldn't be there it would have been boring so i kind of like this this way and i've been watching case on the cover the entire morning and the entire afternoon i'm almost done with season three and guys let me tell you it's case in the cover please we watch this title series because guys it's zendaya this actress zendaya Okay guys, it's currently 7pm and I'm going to go back home because ah, tomorrow is Monday and tomorrow I have school. I really need summer break. Summer break, can, please can you please come and hurry up because I really need summer break. The last school week was, it was, okay, it was a good year but it wasn't the best year. I don't know why but it's just mental health and just people at my school, just school work, exams has been killing me and I really need a break from all this school stuff. So I'm really happy that in two weeks I finally have summer break. Ah, but guys, that was it with the little video of me getting into the summer spirit. I hope you liked this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe and comment down below and we'll see us in the next video. Be yourself and I will love you. Bye!